Hello and welcome to July the 5th edition of the sub-project meeting for KS Contributor Communications. Um, it is a sub-project of the SIG Contributor Experience and uh, this meeting is under the code of conduct of the Kubernetes project, um, which basically means in short story, um, be excellent and nice to each other. Um, most of the folks that are US based are out due to public holiday. Uh, today uh, is, as mentioned, the 5th of July. Um, we have the habit that everyone uh, who would like to do this can introduce themselves. Um, so I will start. Hi, I'm Mario. I'm the tech lead for SIG Contrib X Coms. And I'm also a shadow for the sub project. Uh, and I'm furthermore involved with SIG Contrib X and with SIG Kate's Infra. I work for Kubernetes, and my pronouns are he, him. Anyone else want to introduce themselves? Hello, hello, everyone. Uh, my name is Arvind. I am a developer and student from India. Uh, I'm, uh, I'm recently involved with the uh, contributor comms project, uh, and I'm the blogging lead shadow and the uh, com shadow for KCS, and my pronouns are he, him. Thank you. Um, I got to go. I'm, I'm Fred. Um, I work at the, at SAS and I'm the blogging lead in C Contribux comps, but I also uh, assist in other uh, things. I'm currently also a member of the Kubernetes release team and I'm a CNCF ambassador and my pronouns are he, him. Uh, hi everyone, I'm Arjun and uh, I'm a contributor here. So yeah, and my pronouns are he and him. Thank you. All right, that's it. That's all. Um, let's go directly into the new items. Um, uh, the first item came from me. It's basically um, there was at one point the interest uh, about having a blog post for SIGKATE's infra, uh, especially with a, with a spotlight on what has happened the last year. Um, also to highlight a little bit the support that we got there. Um, originally, I was supposed to write this, but to be brutally honest, um, it's now with me since March and I haven't done anything um so i would give this up for the taking so i can give some input uh, regarding uh what has happened uh and uh, what to write about uh but uh i currently lack the time to write it up it yeah. oh anyone anyone of you can start talking <laughs> yeah, I, I was just uh, going to say that um, I mean uh, it, that's great to be it, it's another one that's up for the taking um, if, if someone wants in, in this call uh, already wants to display some interest obviously that's great otherwise I will uh, add that one as a request in our channel as part of the shadowing thing so that uh, okay. just like we did uh, with the I... security for example so yeah uh, hello am I audible Yes, yes, you are up it. Uh, yeah, so I am saying if you uh, want, I can uh, write the blog post. Uh, we can discuss it about uh, it after the meet. Sure. This sounds good to me. So up, uh, I, um, then we, uh, Frederico, will you create the the tracking issue, or should I quickly create it in the board? I, I mean, either either works. I I can certainly create it uh, as well. So if you want to proceed, go on, and I'll I'll do it uh, later today. Um, yeah. I'll create yeah. the issue, and then I, I will also I'll, uh, help with the PR. Yeah, that's that's good for me. Okay, perfect. 
by the way um, uh, uh, is this the uh, spotlight blog or a separate blog on uh, case and that's a separate block. So the idea would be that this would be a separate block. It's not like a, a spotlight block. It would be like, um, so I talked with CNCF and I talked with uh, the leadership uh, or steering. And it's basically a block about uh, the effort that has been undertaken last year by SIG Infra to um, migrate into this multi-cloud setup and the ongoing uh, and the ongoing topics um, in this area so uh, to to publish this uh, and make it available so that people are aware what what work has been done okay makes sense i think there was also one uh, blog post about how much kubernetes spends i think that was also uh, Physically going to be written in collaboration with Gates and Fra. I think yeah, so. I, 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 to be honest, uh, I would basically, I would basically combine both because that they, um, you, you can't tell the story without, uh, without telling about the, uh, the, the, um, uh, the spend. Uh, however, this was lying around since a couple of times now, and uh, um, I was the person that was to be approached and no one approached me so and uh, chris now uh, chris now asked for the article uh because i talked to some folks from aws um because and they were asking um they were asking if if this article is now being written and chris asked what what could be done to help and i basically said that i just currently don't have the time and uh, we both thought that it would be a good idea to bring it up in comms so that anyone can basically write it. Mm -hmm. All right. Then I will uh, write down RPID as the mm. Also, uh, is it going to be an interview kind of a blog or like a normal blog? Uh, it will be a normal blog. Yeah. Or it should be normal block, uh, isn't it? Yeah. Yeah. That is what uh, I want to clarify this. Yeah. It should basically tell the story what what we did last year. And uh, we will have uh, a little so, bit. Yeah. Go ahead. Uh, yeah, you can continue. Uh, so my basic idea is so like I have to interview some folks regarding this, uh, yeah. and then I will write. Uh, a normal blog instead of uh, the uh, basic structure we follow on the spotlight ones. Uh, so I need to follow a normal blog uh, guidelines and like uh, write it, right? Yeah, yeah. And uh, I can also point you to uh, certain people uh, to interview. Um, uh, that makes sense to to give you some input. For uh, so, for example, Marco Mandrucic will be one of them. And um, he is currently on vacation for two more weeks, but uh, uh, when he's back, uh, he is definitely one you should you should interview because he did a, a lot of the heavy lifting there. All right. Um, next topic is by Arvind. The update on the six scheduling block. Uh, yeah. So. Uh, we basically completed the uh, spotlight block, so uh, all the questions were answered, and then I made the uh, HackMD uh, version of it, basically converted it to Markdown, and uh, I've sent it to Frederico, and he, he he will I think he will raise the PR for it soon. So uh, yeah. Yeah. I will review it yesterday, as I promised. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah, no worries. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry for that. I've been bitten by. Um, there was a, the tunnel that leads to the Israel airports. Apparently, it was closed, and I was bitten by that. So I, I'm a bit delayed in terms of getting back. So um, I will try to do it today after the football match. So either will I, I will be happy or sad, but either way, I will review it. It's Spain. You're also right, Federico. Uh, or which one you're watching? Uh, no, nah, it's close, but it's Portugal. Ah, it's Portugal. Uh, today, it's, and yeah, it's Portugal's France uh, today. Ah. So, yeah. Ah. 
Yeah, we have we have Spain Germany. So in Spain Germany, so and whomever wins these two will face in the semi-final. So yeah, yeah, yeah. It's going to be interesting. I I will I will bet on I uh, I will bet on Spain. <laughs> yeah, I mean, this are everything is possible. So there's no at at this stage. I don't think it's yeah. It's just, yeah, uh, that's, yeah, that's true. I just want to enjoy it, and that's it. But uh, anyway, thank you very much for the work on the on the article. Um, I'm yeah. I we've I, I, we've talked like two days ago. I said that I would I have to review it yesterday. I I didn't, but I I, I it's something that will be done this week. So uh, that's another great work and another thing that we may we, we can push forward um, in the short term. Yeah, that's that's great. Yeah, and thank you for the help. Uh, with it. All right. Any other new items that we have missed or that we might miss? If not, we can continue to uh, updates and big wins. Um, so far, I don't have any update. Does anyone else have an update on an ongoing topic? If not, then we can basically I, con yes. Uh, there is an update about the uh, doc sprint, which was basically discussed in the last meeting. If we were having one, so I think it's now finalized that we are having one. So uh, I just thought of mentioning it. Mm, yeah, but it's for the contributor summit, right? So there will be a doc sprint at contributor summit. Yeah. Ah, uh, yeah. Yeah, it's too much in parallel, but yeah, this is for contributor summit and we will have a doc sprint, which is great. So we found someone there. Um, the good thing is that there is no need for any communications regarding this. The only thing that we need to do is update the contributor website again. Um, All right, then let's dive into the board because last week we couldn't. Um, uh, let me. So we have ready for review uh, the shadowing guide for ContribX blogging. I think that Kathleen wanted to review it, but she hasn't yet gotten around to it. Yeah, I, I think that's it. I, I at least I don't recall having any comments to to process, but I'll, I'll give it a look as well. But uh, uh, but I, I think that's that's it. Yeah. Then the next item is at config x comes block shadow guide. Isn't this the same? Ah, it's the PR. Uh, ah, yeah, it's the PR of the issue. Yes. <laughs> Uh, wait a second. There were some comments. There were some comments. Okay, so I uh, so that's on me. I need to go there and review it. Yeah. So basically, uh, I I think then basically when when this is reviewed, then we can merge it. Merge. Yeah. And then close okay. the other the other one. Yep. Yeah. Uh, the the other one will I uh, if it's done correctly, it will be yeah, closed. Yeah, close. Yeah, exactly. And uh, the SIG API, uh, then we have in review the pull request for the SIG API machinery. Um, there yeah. were also some comments. Yes. Um, I asked uh, SIG docs to give it a look, um, as I mentioned last, not last week, but well, last week by in, in, in the Slack channel. Um, I know we have some uh, comments there, and I, I, I actually have addressed them in my uncommitted version. Uh, that being said, I think, but uh, I'm sorry, I'm I'm on the move, so I can't uh, look at details. And um, I don't the, the comments, which are very helpful. They are, I don't think they are from the Sigdox reviewers uh, uh, yet, right? Uh, I'm just mentioning this because um, to get the LGTM, we do need 
for the Sig Docs reviewers to go there. And it didn't seem to be from Sig Docs because the comments were not. Um, it, generally, Sig Docs suggests things as um, diffs, um, mm -hmm. and that wasn't the case. But I, I might be mistaken in something. So let me. Maybe we just, uh, yeah, maybe just ping Sig Docs again. And, uh, yeah, I will. Uh, yeah. I, I, I went to their, their channel uh, and asked, so I, I will do that again. Yeah, I mean, I mean, let's be honest, uh, this week is a rather short week for a lot of folks in the US and in Canada. Yeah. Um, so yeah. We, we should keep this in, uh, in account as well. Um, that's everything that we have and ready for review. Uh, the in progress to have is um, the one that is for me, notify comms team when there's a new issue created. Uh, I created a pull request for uh, a new issue template for comms requests. Um, there were some minor changes that I still need to do. Um, that's on me. I hope that I can do it next week. Um, and can, that we can have the new issue template. And uh, then we have an automatic, uh, automatic not, um, notification when someone creates a new issue. All right. The next topic is the uh, SIG architecture spotlight. And it's currently with... With me. With, with you. Yeah. yeah, no, I mean, uh, some more discussions around the filling up the missing um, one, but uh, still waiting for for feedback. So yeah. I, I do hope that this month we will get something, but uh, this week was not uh, ideal to, to press the subject. Yeah, I, I can understand. Then we have the ETCD spotlight article. This is also with you, and you're waiting for feedback. This was the last uh, update a month. And ago. I'm still waiting. So, uh, um, and I'm still waiting for feedback. So they, they, the the answers were, yeah, were sent. Um, also with the shadow, etc. Uh, and I think now it's time to to ask them because it's uh, around the beginning of July was the target date. So maybe yeah. starting next week, I'll, I'll gently ping them to ask if it's if it's done. Yeah, this sounds good. Then we have uh, the six security spotlight. Um, the, the last uh, last update was in June. That questions has been sent. Have been sent. Yep. And uh, some some update as the ATCD one. Um, okay. They are they were the, the, the six, so six security took a, a bit more. To express to, to confirm the interest, but then we sent the questions, um, and I mean around one month is typically the, the a good amount of time before asking. But I think now it's um, it, it's good to ask them again. Yeah. Then we have the um, six scheduling spotlight block. I think this is with you, Arvind. Ah uh, yes. What is the current status there? Uh, yeah, I've create, created the Markdown version and then uh, Federico will be raising the PR. Yeah, yeah, you're right, you're right. I'm sorry. We, we, just, we just talked about it. It's Friday e uh, evening. I'm, I'm so sorry. Yeah, so yeah. basically it's... Uh, we can already move it to ready for review, right? More or less. It's ready for review. Mm -hmm. All right, then I know that no, nothing has been done regarding the help wanted posts. Uh, I know that there's no update on the Sepia code uh, tool. Um, the sensitive communication process, uh, some comments were made by Chris um, and I need to work them in. Uh, into the document, and once we have this, uh, we can basically raise a PR, but it's still ongoing. Um, and same goes for the guidelines for the Kubernetes IO Twitter uh, Twitter account handling. So that that's basically the same. That's all. 
that's all now again with me uh, that I update this. Um, in the to do column, we have the buffer access up audit, which I think is still. Um, uh, it's something that we need to do. Um, SIG app spotlight uh, blog article is with Sandipan currently. He's not in the meeting. So, uh, ah, the question has been shared, which was the last update, I think, last week ago. So, uh, I'm not expecting any, any news there soon. Um, the steering, the steering spotlight block. Does anyone know anything about this? No. Um, and it's with Arpit. Uh, which one? Arpit, the steering spotlight block. That's with you, right? Uh, yeah. Yeah, I have uh, written the questions and I, uh, I have two layers, uh, like ping the steering members for this. So I will do this uh, this week. Okay. So, um... Yeah, it, uh, you can actually uh, move it to in progress, actually. Okay, then, then let me do this and... Yeah. Um, I move it into progress and I convert it into an issue. They are in contributor side, right? So the issues for those, yeah, they are in contributor side. Uh, convert to issue contributor side. Uh, also for the docs one, uh, I am currently preparing the questions for that. Uh, so uh, that's your uh, call if you want to move it into in progress or not. But I am still preparing questions for that. Okay, now then then let's keep it where it is currently, uh, and I will just update it um, with um, prepare. questions <clears throat> and the last one that is with you is the kubectl spotlight up at this you were you expressed some interest is this still active otherwise i would just remove you I can't hear you if you're talking. I mean, we can even uh, update this later on. Um, yeah, the SIG infra, the, the spotlight for SIG infra is still um, is still open, um, but I don't I don't think that we need to to uh, assign it right now. And the duplication uh, process to pre uh, the establishment process to prevent duplication, uh, there has been some movement there with Josh uh, that we basically probably just going to use a spreadsheet file because it's it's easier to track um, and to update that uh, this file. Um, this issue is about that uh, we don't post. Uh, duplications of caps in uh, LWKD's um, newsletter uh, episodes. All right. Any other topic that I have missed or forgotten? Uh, I actually talked to Kathleen uh, three days back about working on a spotlight on SIG UI. Mm -hmm. Oh, SIG so UI. So, yeah, I have pinged them. The yeah. Uh, team leads so maybe you can put that on to do or in progress uh yeah i will i will add a sick uh which one which sick was it again Sorry. ui ui sick ui spotlight and um let's see if i can assign it to you uh a R U 
V A L V V. No, you cannot assign. Uh, can you just uh, write your your uh, GitHub handle in the chat? Then uh, then I can basically copy it in. Uh, ah, I can't add you because you're probably you're not a um, uh, you're not a member. member org member yet, right? But what we can do is we can copy uh, change it to. Uh, to an issue and then I can try uh, and then you can grab it yourself. So you can now go ahead and basically uh, you should now be able to say assign uh, slash assign and then yourself to grab yeah, it. Okay. All right. And I will move it into progress. This looks good. Great. Any other topic that is missing? If not, I want to have this on record. We did the full meeting in 33 minutes with three minutes starting late, um, which brings us back to uh, German efficiency. <laughs> <laughs> uh, I wish all of you a pleasant weekend and we will talk to each other next week. Likewise. Have a great weekend. Cheers. Bye, folks. Bye-bye.